What's what's going on, my fellow collectors? I'm back again with another review, guys. And today, it's an unboxing. It's an unboxing. I know you guys out there are like, oh shit. What you got now? Is it 3A or is it Hot Toys? That's the whole beauty of it all now, guys. <laughs> you never you can know, you know, with me, as far as in the collecting's habit. I t will tell you this, though. Nine times out of ten, it's going to be uh, Hot Toys or 3A. You know what I mean? I'm totally 3A now, guys. They, they got a place in my heart. Place in my heart now, you know, and, and they are truly like pieces of art to me. And one thing that makes 3A special is that, um, you know, what I think that 3A does different from Hot Toys is you got a Hot Toy figure, but basically, basically, this Hot Toys figure is based off of something, which is a movie. And, you know, it's from that real life actor. So, Hot Toys is doing that, and they're the kings that are doing that, you know, exactly trying to copy that likeness of that that real life actor and everything. And it's been done all before, you know, by other 1-6 companies. But what makes 3A shine is that Ashley Wood is producing these 1-6 figures and it's all from his mind. It's straight pieces of art from this guy's concept paintings, you know, thoughts that he had, and he's putting his muscle in himself. You know, such a passionate artist, guys. He's putting his muscle in himself, and then he'll put some saying on the side of the figure, like, fuck off. <laughs> you know what I mean? Or whatever the case may be, or bang. You know, and basically that just means that, look, I do what I want. I put what I want on my figures because this is my company, and that's how it is. So that's what makes them genuinely pieces of art to me, man. One, six pieces of art. So enough rambling on. Let's get into this unboxing. Now, I know you guys are wondering what it is, and you cannot find out until I open the box. And you know that's how we do with these surprise unboxes, guys. And another thing I want to touch on, too, guys. Um, definitely was thinking about maybe doing a separate channel, maybe for 3A, and then maybe for, you know, Hot Toys. Don't know, it was thought. So let me know what you guys think on that, you know. And, and if you like that idea, let me know, you know. But, uh... This is from Alter Ego, little card, basically the, the paper, you know, they come with it. Wrap pretty cool, got its protection paper. Alrighty, let's pull it out the box. Ah. Oh, what is that? What is that right there? What do you got? The big box. <laughs> what do you got right there? So, um... A friend of mine was telling me, guys, what do you guys think about reviews? Because I look at our reviews as basically the point of view of that collector, that friend that you invited to, you know, your YouTube channel or, you know, whatever the case may be. Yeah, we all do the same reviews, but we like to hear what each other think on that figure that we just got. You know, if it's worth it, if we like it, and it's thorough to hear that opinion from a whole bunch of different collectors. So... That's why I think everybody should make sure they get down and review their figures and let, let us know what we think. So, alrighty, coming out the box, coming out the box, and we have it right here. <laughs> bang, bang, guys. Family in the clutches, family in the clutches. The tracker makes the trio done and complete. So, Rick. Here you go, brother. You know I got to bust your balls, man. How can you think your fellow brother collector is turning away from hot toys, man? You know what I mean? So, here you go, bro. This is for you, Rick. <laughs> this is for you, brother. But uh, the box is nice and large, guys. Got the slip cover. Basically the same as the other, other boxes from the Predator series. It's more flat. Looking good, looking good. Let's see what this guy looks like, guys. Picture is lovely on the front. Ooh, <laughs> he's a monster. He's a monster right here, guys. Check it out. Let's open him up. Let's open this bad boy up, guys. He's looking real vicious. Definitely is a big fan of the Predators, guys, and I'm getting yet new Predator. 
the, uh, what is it, the Predator from the Predator movies. Definitely get that new guy. Um, waiting for them to make other figures. You know, and that's just the thing, guys. I'm, I'm pro Hot Toys just like I'm going to be pro Ashley Wood figures. And with all this stuff that Hot Toys bringing out, how can you stay mad? Just come down on the prices. As you can see, he's in the protective shell. Mmm, smell that paint already, guys. <laughs> Let's smell that paint already. Ooh, freshness. Looking amazing. He's a beast. He's a beast, guys. I know he got twisty ties probably on Oh, no. He oh. Head fell off, guys. I'm gonna put that back on though. I did not know this guy had the 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 light on his head though. Did not know that. Let's try to get it back in there. Oh, that sucks, guys. But you see him right here. Basically the tracker, predator. Happy to add him to the collection. And look for new reviews of hot toys coming, guys. You know, true hot toys all the way in 3A2 though. Gotta let y'all know that. So stay tuned, guys. Tracker Predator. It's a shame his head came off, but I gotta get that back on. He looks good, though. Peace!